can't find time to study for the FE, you work full time, you want to hang out with your friends and family, where are you going to find time to study? Well, if you want a better study life balance, then keep watching. Hey guys, my name is Kenza and with my online courses, I've helped hundreds of students just like you pass the FE exam. When it comes to making time to study for the FE, the first step I recommend is don't be afraid to ask the people around you for help. The FE covers everything an engineer is expected to know. It will be hard. It will challenge you. So don't hesitate to ask the people closest to you for a little extra help during this journey. Explain to your family, friends, and boss that studying for the FE is temporary but stress that it will be very important for your career. Take our student Anthony, for example. When he was studying for his FE exam, he asked his wife and boss for help. His wife was extremely understanding and helped him a lot by looking after their kids more. And his boss was also very supportive and more lenient. I know some of you are nervous about the possible pressure of telling your boss about taking the FE. Because if you fail, what will you tell them? What I recommend is to let them know that you're studying, but without telling them exactly when you'll be taking it. This way, if you don't pass, you don't have to tell anyone if you don't want to. Also, if you really want to avoid failing, check out our courses. Our students feel confident when they take their FE, and this shows in our 92% pass rate. So check the link below for some of our courses. If you're enjoying this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to get more great tip videos like this. Now, tip number two, figure out how much time you actually need to study. See, asking how to find time to study is useless without first asking how much time. Without knowing how much time you actually need to study, it's impossible to figure out where to fit that into your schedule and you'll end up paralyzed. Of course, a lot of times students think that they need to study four or more hours a day. The truth is, you don't. Our students spend only one to two hours on weekdays and four to five hours on Saturday and Sunday. Now, once you figure out how much time you want to spend, then you can create a realistic study schedule. Now, if you want to learn how to create a study schedule that will work for you, check out this webinar here. With a completed study schedule, all that's left is to block time to study. Now, time blocking is when you block time for tasks or activities during your day. If you want to be more intentional about your time, then time blocking is for you. It's okay to check on Junior's Instagram page if you need some motivational quotes, as long as you're intentional about it. Time blocks are a great way for showing you how your time is being wasted. A three hour block every day doing chores is probably not helping you study for the FE. So this would be a great time to ask your family for help. Time blocking protects your time. Instead of wondering, what should I be doing today at 6 p.m.? One look at your time block calendar tells you instead to study. If someone invites you out, hit them with, sorry, I'll be studying then. If you don't protect your time, no one will. My favorite part about time blocking is that it removes the need for decision making. See, relying on willpower alone will not keep you on track to study. Willpower, it's like a battery. After a long day filled with decisions, it'll be empty. So remove willpower from the equation altogether. If it's on your time block calendar, you do it. No decisions needed. If you want to make a time block calendar of your own, go ahead and comment below time block and I'll make a video on that. Also, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notifications so you don't miss any future great tip videos. And go ahead and check these two videos that I have right here for you, which will help you with your FE preparation. Now, thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great week, and I will see you on the next video. A la prochaine. Oh yeah,